I still remember their first encounter. Was it the Upward. cafeteria? Yeah. Up. He came in and wanted to know if they had any water. And Elise was working concession. And she said, yeah. And he said, well, how much is it? And she told him. And he just took off running. <laughs> I thought he was a nice, nice guy for Elise. Yeah, and he was really clean cut, as, yeah. as you can tell. He was tell. really yeah. good to her. Yeah, he was really good to her. That's what's most yeah. important. And what we're happy about is they married their best buddy. Yeah. And it shows. Can I be close to you? So for the first five years of John's life, I lived with him. So he was always my little brother more than my nephew. Five years ago, I went out to dinner on New Year's Eve with John and Elise, and it was the first time I met Elise. I just kind of knew that night that she was part of my family. Now I feel like I got a sister, even though she's my niece, but <laughs> I feel like I got a sister, and I'm just so thankful to have them in my life all the time as my friends and my family. I lived with them for a good nine days, I think. Some good nine days, let me tell you. I watched Parks and Rec the entire series, seven, eight seasons. It was some of the best nine days. I got to just sit back, relax, hang out with John and Lise, laugh together. I always put a smile on my face when I'm around them. You know, I love them. They're some great people. That's uh, really all I have to say. Uh, John, he's, he's something, yeah. I don't really have any stories. Just, just keep doing what you're doing, you know? I love you guys. I think we're doing much. I've known John since I was born, um, and I always wanted to be like him. He's just always been there for me and been a great brother. Keep loving Elise because she's awesome. So we love you so much and we're so happy for you. I uh, just want to say we love you and so proud of you and let you guys know we are always here for anything you need and we just appreciate if you would come visit us more often. Love you. John and Elise, congratulations. I love you almost as much as John loves my dog's peanut butter, which is quite a lot. Have a great life together. First time I met Elise, it's because we bonded over Disney music, and it was love at first sight. And then I met John. When I first walked into their home, Elise greeted me first, and it instantly just felt like home. They were super nice and caring and everything. Um, and then I met John, and our eyes locked. And uh, when I first saw them together, I, I just knew that we, they, they would be together forever. And, I'm so happy for them. So happy Elise is with John. You know, at least I still get to talk to John on the phone and we still have our little you hang up first. But we love you guys. I love her more. So I always told John that she was my friend first. <laughs> I remember first getting to know Elise uh, when she came to work at Chick-fil-A and she was just a teenager. And I thought, this is such a wonderful girl. I love her. Then I thought, oh man, she would make a great wife for John. <laughs> and then they met. And I love them to pieces. Well, Randy obviously has extremely high standards, or I wouldn't be standing. <laughs> she also has final approval on any marriages in the family. If she doesn't like it, you're in trouble. <laughs> We're very pleased. Elise's a wonderful young lady. John has his feet on the ground. His grandparents and parents, that's all you can ask for. We're very proud. And we, you know, I will say it, live long and prosper. <laughs>
in a letter Shall I try to get it down Boy, you fill my head with pieces Of a song I can't get out Can I be close to 